we just got into here, but it looks pretty wicked. Sort of a manway here on the side. Got some rail here. Beautiful rock tunnel. That's where we just came in from. Backfilled to the hill. Right off the bat, what is that? <laughs> I mean, that's not a locomotive, right? That's just an old. Yeah, it looks like an old cart. coal cart. Sweet, huh? Yeah, man, this is freaking awesome. And we got a split here. Whoa, and you do not want to go to the left. Look at that. The tracks kind of imploded into the ground. Wow. Almost like the ground gave way here, Maybe, huh? Oh, like right here. I think it's all been filled in, but this was a, a way down on this cool shovel right here, too. Leaning up against the post. That's awesome. And a doorway here. Yeah, it looks like there's going to be so much to check out on this first level alone that overwhelmed as soon as you get in here. Maybe we'll make it down there some more. Oh, wow. What? Holy smokes. Yeah, it looks like the clearance gets pretty low back there, but that goes. Oh, damn. There's another doorway. Yeah, back there. Look at that gob wall. Whew. Looks like it's almost full enough to roof, but this is a pretty solid rock tunnel, I think. I mean, <laughs> and then I'm gonna eat my words. Look at the size of this roof collapse up here. Yeah, good collapse here. Subsidence. Wow, look at that, and the rail just continues. These are some of the most intact tracks I've ever seen. Main haulage. Some kind of room, maybe it was the foreman's office. The other side of that gob wall. Check that out. Oh, nice. I guess that power would have ran a light in here. Yeah, the light was right there. Right into the solid rock. I like the way they utilize the rock for the rooms. Very cool. I mean, this might be the most solid room in the entire mine, actually. Oh, yeah. There was no coal in here. It's all rock. Look at this thing disintegrating. That's crazy. There's gloves everywhere. We have got two sets of tracks here. Maybe inbound and outbound? Yeah, wow. A little space right down the middle. Yeah, hey, look at that. It's like barely a, touching the rails, though. It's too narrow of a gauge, isn't it? For these tracks. So it wasn't, couldn't have been used on that rail. Maybe they drug it there, huh? Looks similar to something we saw in that other mine, the Gates from Hell. Oh, yeah. Because this thing would just chew up the railroad ties, right? Yeah, it's riding right on the wood. So, I don't know. That's very cool, though, nonetheless. Yeah. So I guess there's a skinnier, more narrow gauge rail in here for that thing to run on. I'm just have having... been maybe no. I was gonna say right down the middle here, but that wouldn't make sense because the tracks converge right here. What's going on up here? Another slope. That's what. Wow. That's two internal slopes. That is so nuts. The and second this one internal is slope. A big one. There's some sort of old sign. Can't make it out. Dude, what do you want to do? Look look what's ahead. You want to check that out oh, yeah, first? Oh yeah, because we... that's a hoist. Oh my goodness. And that would have pulled 
The cart's right down from this slope here. Oh, oh no. You said we didn't see any workings yet. I there guess. you have it. The working pitch from hell. I bet you that slides right down in the water too. Oh, I am man. not being over dramatic. That is as deadly as it gets. So I guess we're safe if we walk right through here. That is insane. Right there, we're level. Whoa. Oh, that is just crazy. Where do you suppose that goes to over there? <laughs> Man. That working looks like it continues, but you're not getting over this. There's no way. That is completely nuts. Dude, did you did you look up here? No. Holy wow! And that goes off to the left there. That's dude, that's all part of the same pitch. I'm getting vertigo just standing. Seriously. There. Let's check this hoist down. Now. It's got some supports into the roof here to keep it from going forward when it's pulling up those coal cars. Wire rope still on it. Oh, wow. Right there is probably a false floor. Dude, where does that go? Oh, it keeps going. Dude, I've never been over there. No. Well, somebody's been here before because we have uh, some arrows. Wow. Yeah, Dude, another <laughs> split. Wow. There's your workings. And what goes up here? Guessing. That is ridiculous. I can't even imagine them working that. And it all just dumped out right here. Yep. Yeah. Dude, I had no idea this was even here. And that. There's definitely a glass or some kind of back door. Is that one solid piece of paper or is this where they just stopped driving the tunnel through? Oh, dude. Yeah, that's nuts. Oh. Okay, so it goes up about 20 feet into the vein there and stops. Oh, it does go up. Yeah. So we're back at that, in front of the hoist there, at this slope here that goes down. So let's go check it out. Wow. Looking back. But that's cool though, they got nice concrete walls there. Yeah, it almost reminds me of like an above ground slope that right, goes down, the surface. right? Uh, yep. So cool, the internal slopes. Now that is pretty steep. <laughs> Look at that. It's got rail. It's got rail. It's got uh, railroad ties, so maybe we'll get good footing going down. Okay, so it's going down. And it looks like it splits off to the right here. Is that a vein or just coal dust? Wow. <laughs> I think that's just dust. Reminds me of an underground roller coaster. Keeps going down. Yes, indeed, man. This is a deep slope. Wow, so this wraps around through there, another big intersection. To the right. Looks like it might go down into water there, but I can't tell yet. 
It's flooded out, dude. Yeah. It was still a pretty awesome slope, though. Catch on camera. Terminates right into the water. Yep. All right. We're back at that first main intersection with the coal car there. The slope here. I don't know why it says out, because we definitely came from that direction. Yeah, what's up with that? Let's go check that out. Maybe there is another way out. Look at that. Man way off to the left, going down. Guess we'll push it as far as we can. Working pitch going up. You can see the pitch of the roof here, kind of going down to the left. That's the same way the coal vein was going, and that's the way they chased it. And then toward the back there, I think the vein actually went almost vertical, which is amazing. Oh, yeah. Let's get through this spot quickly. Light-footed. Right through. Exit, okay. Wow. This makes sense now. Yeah. Because that is... Old backfill slope. Check that out. Oh, that's nice. That could have been the main way down here back in the day. So that there is holding all the uh, backfill. Because you know how hard it would be to just dump truckloads of dirt there oh, to yeah. fill it in. So that's holding it all back. And that's why it hasn't subsided open. No. I don't see nothing. Not even a peak. I guess if you had to. You dig, right. Oh, damn. Yeah, literally a jam, huh? Concrete portal. That's cool. So we just came back down from that concrete portal slope manway thing there. And the, it just keeps going this way. Well, we can make it over those rock piles. Let's keep pushing. Yeah, let's go for it. Sketch City. Population two. Currently two. Maybe some animals. But the roof above what fell, dude, is solid. You know, pretty solid. Yeah, now it is. <laughs> <laughs> Not all the loose pieces fell down. These metal beams were... They didn't move, though. They just went right... Right around, around them. them, yeah. The tracks continued, though. We couldn't see them. Oh, nice. Some sort of giant wheels. Whoa. What were they for? I don't know. Some kind of spools, maybe, for cable? What's that all about? Yes. Wow. And there's old Whoa. bucket. What's there up? There is a mammoth hoist up ahead. A hoist? Oh, look at that. <laughs> a big one. And it was here because there's <laughs> another slope. It was pulling the cars up this slope. Slope number three, apparently. Yeah, I think they guided the wire rope or something. One of them spins still. Wow, it goes that way. Tiny little room. That's where we came from. Totally epic mine. There's your vein, which isn't, uh, it's a pretty good size, right? Five, four or five foot vein. Hinges on the door. Some electrical wire with some insulators. Up ahead here, a massive hoist. This right here is an epic find. I just need to touch it for whatever reason. <laughs> Dude, it's bigger than you are. It really is. A monster. Yes, beast. A supply shelf right here. Oh, look at the gear. So how noisy do you think this was when it was cranking? Did it like reverberate the entire mine? Dude, nasty. Nasty. Must have been pretty epic though, don't you think? Pulling in the wire rope. Yeah. And then like the sound of the, the carts coming up the tracks, like banging through it, like loaded up with coal. I would do anything to see that. This piece of American machinery. Bad ass, don't you think? Oh, 
Look at the wall back here. Bellowing went out. Who knows how long that's been like that. Let's get a look at this. Oh man, dude, the view from the back is just insane. Think of how much grease this would need to be maintained with, right? Gallons. It must have stunk over here bad. They must have had barrels full of grease. And there's some kind of a dial right there that tells them how deep they are. Right. Tells them when they, you know, let out the spool, how much spool, uh, rope they let out gets to a certain level. They know when to stop. The motor is gone. The electric motor, they took it out. Oh, they did? Yeah. Look at this. I need to get some still shots. Speechless. Total beast. Okay, we're going to take a quick look up in that control room there. Almost looks like it's the main power substation for this mine. We're just going to tread lightly. <laughs> Holy wow. smokes. Look at this. <laughs> All breakers. You rarely ever see something like this. Wow. Oh, the control room with all the circuitry still in it. Wow. Hundreds of breakers, man. Must have been a huge operation. That box is really intact. I'm sure the grease helped. Westinghouse safety switch. Let's open it up here. Isn't that something? Look at that. Instructions. Two monster fuses. Another one there. Oh, that might be the, the culprit that's, right there. That's it right there. Don't dip your finger in that. Here's the cables that would have fed the uh, motor on the hoist. Going down into the ground. Three phase. Okay, so back there is the hoist, and here's the slope that it was actually servicing, and uh, that's the way we came in. We're gonna go take a look down this way and uh, see if there's anything down here. Looks like you can get around it to the right. Got rail here, narrow gauge. Just looking back up it. Super slippery. Looking over that collapse and more rail keeps going. Check it out, dude. Look at this. Phil found something. Joe DiMaggio. Give me 1942. Get out of here. Look at that. It's still in oh one my piece. God. How is that not disintegrated? Talk about a piece of history. Wow, look at that. Just laying here on the gob wall. Wow. <laughs> I would I would say why, but who cares? I mean, this is great. I feel like we just stepped into a time machine. So I guess this was the uh, sports section. Oh, there's some comics. You got your funnies. Jeez. Whose face is that? Cecil Travis. Okay. Not as famous as Joe DiMaggio, but. Joe's right there swinging the there bat. He is. Badass. Whoa. Newspaper with Joe DiMaggio with the Yankees. What was the year on that, Phil? 1942, January 8th. So we've been down here for quite a while. And uh, we were getting ready to just pack up and push out of here. But I think we're going to go down this slope just a little bit more, especially since we just found that. Because who knows what lies ahead. Another one of those wheels. Yeah, the slopes lined with those. Pretty cool. Someone's got to tell us what these are for. It does. Whoa, dude. What is this? Oh what is this? You can see right through the, the top of it here. Two concrete walls, some steel on the, rail on the top. What's going on up there? Oh, my God. I don't know. Almost looks like some sort of a bridge. 
It is a bridge. Look, there's an arrow pointing over to the... the it goes both the ways. Look at the way they cut that out. Oh, man, there's another slope. Oh, really? Yeah, look at that. Oh, my God, two more yeah, of those slopes. We said we saw three. And I bet you that goes up to the first level. Okay. The first one that we saw, actually. Look at this. And then, <laughs> over here. Underground bridge. Let's see if we can get on top of the bridge, dude. Dude, I'm on top of the And this just keeps going. Another slope. Where'd this come from? Oh, maybe it was that one That's by the, the first entrance. One. Yep. So this will take us back up? I would imagine. Maybe. Don't know. Wow, look you, at that. You know what this is for? So you have your slope there, all the carts went down it, and this is for the workers to pass right up over the top into those workings on the right that we saw. So they didn't have to worry about the slope? No, I'm standing right on top of the slope where it busted open here. <laughs> look you at walk this. right through this into more workings. I've never seen anything like that. This is so cool. And look at the way they chiseled this out. I don't know how they did that. Almost like they used their drill, you know? Looks like a work of art, though, doesn't it? Yeah. They used some sort of drill. No kidding. Look at this. Up and then back down. And right down there's the slope we just came in on. Looks like a medieval catacomb. So cool. Look at these steps on the other side. It goes up and then back down. So the <laughs> carts will go right underneath you here, down the tracks. And the workers wouldn't be in the way at all. Oh, man. That's freaking sweet. <laughs> what else to say? Perfect set of steps here. Insane. Turn into the workings so they can come down here, avoid the slope and then get to work down here. This just goes everywhere. Huge maze. Keeps going that way. Splits again. It's one, two, three, four. Nice knob walls down here. It's almost right like a workings. six way split into the workings. Six ways. Yeah. Look at well, it. that's why. Look at left, straight, right. You ain't boom, kidding. Boom. That's why they made that there for the workers to pass through. And the vein here was a little flatter, so they were definitely getting it easier than in the back. That looks beautiful down there, too. Here's like a coal card uh, salvage yard here. It is. All the wheels. A little junkyard. All dumped right here for some reason. Oh, man. All right, so we could be down here all week. And this would just lead down to the flooded area. Pretty sure. I'm gonna take a look around the corner here. Yeah, I see water down there. It's a beautiful manway though. Yeah. All right, let's get up these steps and uh, we're gonna call it a day and head back out of here. Appreciate you guys coming along an adventure and we'll catch you on the next one pretty low through here